Hey guys, these are timeless little messages. So if these messages resonate with you guys, hit that like button, like, share, subscribe, you guys. So I'm going to pull from the meditation messages first. I'm getting, um, there's no me without you. There's no meaning to life without you. There's no walk through the park of beating my heart. No, I love you. No, I can't live without you. That is by Tony Braxton. I don't even know if I sung that song right, but I haven't heard that song in so long. But um, this could be a love reading here or somebody feel like they can't live without you or this is you. Okay. Just do it. Okay. Love conquers all. Okay. So this is probably a love reading here. It don't have to be or you just have love a lot of love for somebody here okay permanent something is permanent sharp okay hmm that sharp energy here i'm strongly what i'm getting from that is like if uh, maybe you guys are choosing each other or you're choosing somebody here and this is permanent here and i feel like somebody is like really sharp with it like on their ones and twos, on their P's and Q's here, because they want something to work out or something here. Dollar signs. Hmm. Number 17 could be very significant. The letter U could be very significant. Delete. Hmm. That's not that I don't I, I'm not getting a good energy out of that here. Okay. Maybe somebody see dollar signs here. Okay. Eight days could be very significant here. So I guess we'll see. Okay, something is about the dollar signs or somebody somebody feel like they can make money with somebody here. Okay, I don't know if that's a good thing for you guys or a bad thing. Some people want love. Maybe this is love and dollar signs at the same time. Mm, excuse me. Um, but I'm strongly getting like somebody, um, they may see you as their peace or they want to renew something here with you or this is you um i'm strongly getting like somebody may know your worth or they're confident about your worth or you're confident about somebody here four cups in reverse yeah it's looking like somebody is going to be taking an opportunity here because they're interested in you they're focused on you um obviously you are their world or something here but there's a blockage here there's a blockage with having a reunion with you here. This could be somebody who is still stuck on you, but they're not doing anything. Emperor in reverse here. They, yeah, this is somebody who's wasting a lot of time here. Um, but honestly, this could be somebody who is trying to make progress here. They're trying to work on herself is what I'm getting here. They could be trying to make money here. This could be somebody who is trying to get their finances up here with this five of pentacles in reverse here. Yep. This is somebody who is planning, they're manifesting here, okay? Because maybe this is somebody who actually they know your worth, okay? They know that they, they know that they can't come towards you without a plan, or they can't come towards you without showing that they're responsible or they got their shit together. So this could actually be somebody who is trying to get their shit together. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. There could be somebody who is trying to steal this energy here. Or they try to steal something here. Maybe steal this person, place, or thing. They're, whoever this is. Knight of Cups in reverse. Three of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody is provoking an offer from this person here. Somebody is saying no to this Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Or this Knight of Cups in reverse here. Whoever this person is. They could be somebody who could have been like trying to steal or... This could have been a prostitute here. This could be somebody who's very ungrounded here. They may have tried to block somebody's love life or they tried to block somebody from being with somebody here. Seven of Swords, King of Pentacles. It was about money here. Fooling reverse and a Five of Pentacles here. This could have been somebody who basically was distracting somebody from making progress with their finances or making progress with their self here. Also, somebody who was making progress with trying to get somebody to let go of a relationship. They did this. They schemed this. This is somebody who um, sought out underhandedly 
uh, sabotage probably a connection or this is this is this was their whole mo this could be a narcissist here whoever is queen of pentacles in reverse is this is a narcissist here that tried to force somebody to be with them because they basically tried to scheme some type of revenge or they basically tried to sabotage a connection here this is a clown this is somebody who is narcissistic. They could be sociopathic here. They like to conjure up a circus here all because they wanted some type of high status or they wanted some type of attention or they wanted success and they wanted some type of success in a relationship. Basically, this is somebody who was clout chasing. They saw dollar signs here. Okay, so yeah, I feel like somebody was doing something very sneaky here. They was trying to scheme somebody's money here. Whoever this is, this is a broke-ass hoe. Two of Wands in reverse, Ace of Pentacles, World, Queen of Wands, Star in reverse, Eight of Wands, Judgment in reverse here, Three of Pentacles in reverse, and Seven of Wands here. Somebody feels so defeated here. Okay? This may have been somebody who conjured up a group of people to attack a connection or a group setting or they, they attack somebody here. And I feel like they weren't expecting for somebody to stand up for somebody else or stand up for themselves here because the shit that they were trying to attack somebody on, it didn't work here. They got nothing out of it here. If somebody was trying to um, scheme somebody or they tried to steal some money from somebody, they didn't get no money. They thought that they was going to get some type of opportunity from somebody here, but that's it. the cycle has closed out. It's something about the number eight. Eight days could be very significant here. Yeah, that cycle has closed out here, and I feel like whoever this Queen of Wands is, this person, they, they're sick. It's like... If this person is still trying, is still on this nut ass shit here, they don't have no type of information here. Um, they may be overdoing something here, but they don't really have like perspective of the truth or they're completely imbalanced here. This is somebody who's very chaotic in their energy. It's because they can't, it's, they're not getting something here. They're recklessly trying to communicate something here. They're trying to do something sneaky here. They're recklessly trying to communicate something or they're trying to progress with something that's not true. Okay, judgment in reverse here. This is somebody who is recklessly, they're trying to progress in something that, they, they, they may be trying to progress some type of rumor here or they're trying to progress in something to cause some type of indecisiveness in somebody's decision here. And it could be about malicious gossip here. Somebody could be gossiping, making false accusations about something that's not true. This is somebody who is overdoing something or they're being really extra with something that's permanent or something. I feel like this is somebody who knows this. I feel like this is somebody who may have tried to interfere with a lover's connection here. And they're either they're about to find out that they have no type of power and control. Or this is somebody who's about to have a rude awakening that somebody is still is in love or in love with their person here. That they may have tried to steal. Somebody tried to steal somebody's husband. Yeah, they permanently tried to steal this person. They wanted this person for themselves here. Yeah, so they schemed some type of sabotage to destroy it here. And I feel like that was something that was... They moved really fast with doing so here. Yeah, they got nothing out of keeping somebody stuck. Ten of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles. And this may have been somebody who had been working on this. The number eight. They have been working on this for eight days or eight years. It could have been up to eight years that this person was working on getting this ten of cups from somebody. They was trying. They was working on trying to get somebody stuck permanently. They were working on getting somebody to be indecisive about their decision. They were working on having somebody fearful of the unknown or fearful about their decision here because they were busy trying to steal from this person or keep this person stuck. Okay. They knew, it's, it's almost like this person knew, this This could be another, This obviously this is a karmic or is another woman here. This person, they knew, they know that it wasn't going to be something. They knew it wasn't going to be the Ten of Cups here, but they knew, they also knew that somebody was going to choose somebody else. 
so they sabotaged it or that was their that's what they thought they were doing because i'm getting this energy they didn't do nothing at all is what i'm getting here with this two of wands in reverse they didn't get nothing out of it they wasn't even sure if they was able to actually do this but they did it anyway recklessly here this is somebody who wreaks havoc here um page of pentacles here Somebody is having a new opportunity or a solid new beginning here, okay? I don't think it's with this person here. Two of Swords in reverse and a Ten of Cups here. This Two of Swords in reverse is somebody who... Obviously, somebody see the truth about this person here. Somebody's emotionally detached from this person here. And it's looking like somebody is having a new opportunity somewhere else here. They knew that this person saw dollar signs. I mean, it's right under it. Somebody has seen somebody as a new beginning for them. And that cycle has closed out. I feel like this person is going ballistic here. They're pulling out their fucking hair. Four of Wands in reverse. Yeah, somebody is like, no. Somebody is, is not having... They're not... They're not reuniting with this person. A cycle is closed out and there is no reunion. Something is over here. And I feel like this is like an accomplishment here. Because I feel like somebody may have tried to stir somebody into repeating some type of pattern here with them. This is definitely a karmic lesson. Somebody is karmic. And they aggressively, arrogantly did this here. It's like somebody recklessly tried to steal someone's ten of cups or... Whoever this is, they're, they're, they're very overly confident to steal or they're very overly confident to emotionally manipulate a situation or manipulate somebody here. Um, and obviously, this is this is a karmic cycle here that's ended here. Like somebody is not laying down foundations with somebody here. And that pisses somebody the fuck off, okay? It's like they're looking right out this reading here. Yeah, this is somebody who maybe is a karmic here. They're getting karma. I mean, I feel like this is not something that's bad for this person here. It, that's the crazy part. With this Queen of Wands and this Will of Fortune here, I feel like this is somebody... They're not looking at it at, as a perspective, whereas though it's something that's actually good for them. This could be somebody who don't want to, they don't want to recognize or they don't want to see that this is something that's destined and fated to happen here. Okay, this is a part of some type of positive changes that's going to happen in this person's life. And that's if they actually take this lesson on. It's looking like they are. I mean, it's up right here. Somebody needs to take this as a lesson that they can't, they can't actually, metaphorically speaking here, they can't steal somebody's husband here. They tried, okay? And I feel like this could be somebody who may have psychological issues here or they, they they really tried their hardest to try to manipulate a hot priestess or they may have tried really hard to manipulate somebody's intuition. And honestly, it, it, it's kind of baffling here. I feel like somebody really tried to um, manipulate or trick a psychic or somebody who's very intuitive here and they're kind of psychotic they don't even i'm hearing if i only had a brain like somebody lied and cheat they lie cheat and steal and then when they can't get their way they become bitter and they they act traumatic like this is a traumatic state but it really is something that's really positive for this person if this person can see it but i feel like they do Okay. High Priestess, Two of Cups, in Reverse, Ten of Swords. Somebody really tried to hurt this person here. Somebody was really like an enemy. Somebody did not like that somebody was a Nine of Pentacles energy here. Somebody did not like that somebody was successful and they could stand on their own two feet. So why not steal their husband? Because they can take care of themselves. Uh, this, this is the type of tip. Somebody tried to steal somebody's family. Yeah. And then on top of that, they try to steal somebody's husband or their wife and they try to change this person's perspective about their husband or their wife. 
That did not work. That did not work at all. And it's looking like they're still trying to make progress of doing that here. I'm gonna get from the Kipper deck. There's some shifty shit going on here. Okay. The signs that I strongly got in this reading is Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, Virgo, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, um, Aries, Leo, Pisces, Cancer. Um, the letters that I have in this reading is BKTJ, YHV. Is that all I got? Yeah. Occupation and main female. So whoever this main female is, they got the they got a, the job or they're following their calling here. Somebody is very um intuitive. This could be a high priestess. I feel like this is somebody who this could be somebody who could be a little they, they may have tried to steal somebody's image. Okay, occupation and main female with this Queen of Pentacles energy here. This could be a copycat. A doppelganger here that tried to copy this main female's journey here okay somebody tried to steal somebody's opportunity they tried to steal somebody's husband wife they tried to steal their whole life and it it didn't work and i feel like the lesson is here okay the lesson is here that's if this person wants to take it and it's looking like they are um, it's looking like um, somebody is um, leaving old familiar situations behind here and they're going to choose their person here. And whoever this false person is, they're having a rude awakening here because it's looking like this person, something is ending for this person's person here. It's looking like a relationship. So somebody was a, I'm getting corpse bride if anybody's seen that, Tim Burton, Tim Burton fan here. But I'm strongly getting like this is somebody who may have forced somebody to be in a relationship with them. And they knew that they were like the other woman and they knew that this person wanted to be with. They wanted to marry. They, they want to marry this main female. And this could be a Pisces or Cancer here. North Node energy here because the calling here. Somebody is following. Whoever this main female is, this could be somebody who's following their calling. Could be 34 years old. Okay. Yeah. But this is all I got for you guys. I hope this is very helpful for you guys. Again, these are timely sorted messages. If these messages resonate with you guys, hit that like button, like, share, subscribe, you guys. Also check out my um membership down below and also check out my TikTok. Um, you can find out what my TikTok is through the com you can find out through the community board. You can also um, find out through I forgot what that that thing is called is um, a connection <laughs> but you can also just look for me on TikTok by the name okay it'll pop right up um but this is all I got for you guys I hope this is very helpful for you guys again these are time to send the messages love you guys smooches